Hi everyone, it's Evangeline here at eTrailer and today we'll be taking a look at our replacement rubber fasteners for your Titan chain snow tire chains that have this pull feature here at eTrailer. So this is designed for your Titan chain snow tire chains that are series 1500 or 2300 tire chains. So what that means is if you have this type of Titan chain snow tire chain where you pull it in order to fasten it, this would be the replacement fastener. So if you've lost or damaged your fastener, these are direct replacements and will be exactly what you need. If you don't have this exact Titan chain tire chain or you're not sure if this will fit your tire chain, a way to find out is that this fastener has a hook that fits the links of certain sizes. So that link size is going to be 0.145 inches or 3.7 millimeters thick. So make sure to use a digital caliper to double check if that is the size of your links or not. So my personal thoughts about this fastener is I do like how it is a direct replacement. Especially if you have this broken but it's only a single piece, it's nice to know I can just pick up another piece to replace it and it's not that difficult of a process. Make sure that once you do get it, you are certain about what actually needs replacing on your tire chain. We have replacement parts for your different links, your different fasteners. So check those all out here at eTrailer.com. Also make sure that you have the right tools for the job. If it's just the fastener, any pliers will work. But if you have your other links that need replacing as well, you can pick up our repair pliers from Titan Chain here at eTrailer. All right, so if this is the right fit for you, let's take a quick look at the install replacement process. So I'm gonna show you how to replace these rubber fasteners. So I'm using gloves right now just because what if you're out in the middle of nowhere, it's snowy, it's cold, you'll definitely want these on as you work. Now you are gonna have this link at the end and while you can push the fastener out of that link, I also recommend using some pliers just to give you some extra force. So what we're gonna do is we're first going to twist our fastener so that the link is horizontal across of it. And from here you can either push or pull that off. What I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna use our pliers just to give myself some extra grip as I push that off the hook. And just like that, you have your original fastener removed from that link. So you're gonna get your replacement fastener and line that right up. And it should fit perfectly in there. Now just use your pliers to cinch that down or to tighten that hook. So that should be good right there. You may or may not need to tighten that down all the way because what you're gonna do is just gonna hook it right onto your tire chain. So since the force is pulling away from that hook, having it tightened down won't make that much of a difference. But if you are worried about it, you can bring it all the way down. And from there, just continue installing your tire chain just like you would do with the original fastener. And that was a look here at our replacement fastener for your Titan chain diamond alloy pattern snow tire chains here at eTrailer.